Hello dears good morning and welcome to my geography class in the last video we had discussed about meaning of migration and different types of migration in today's video we are going to discuss about socioeconomic impacts of migration on destination country as well as on the home country so we'll see some of the positive impact of migration on destination country as well as the negative impact on the home country as well as in the, in the destination country now starting with the uh, destination country first we'll discuss some positive impacts now when a migrant reaches to a particular destination then what kind of positive impact that destination country faces or experience first of all they'll be getting cheap labor the migrant often do many unskilled jobs for a very small wage skilled migrants are also often happy to work on a small salary for example migrant laborers from bangladesh work on small wages in india similarly laborer from bihar if you talk within the our country so laborers from bihar works in different states of india in very low wage okay so this is one of the positive impact that a destination country experience secondly they will be getting skilled labor some of the immigrants are highly skilled and talented and they contribute to knowledge and production of the well-being of all in that particular country for example indians who have migrated to the other countries such as the developed countries like usa canada uk dubai singapore these are some of the developed countries where most of the indian migrants have contributed immensely especially to the field of science and technology like most of the indian like scientists or the uh, yeah indian scientists working in nasa so they are basically they are the migrants now the silicon valley in usa is dominated by the asians especially the indians so this also shows that many skilled laborers are migrating from our country to the uh, more developed countries so those countries will experience skilled laborers thirdly there will be a cultural diversity now immigrants provide the diversity in many places like diversity helps cultural and traditional tradition to lose the grip of racism discrimination and so on so diversity help people learn about other way of life and what goes on in the other part of the world it also brings a variety to almost every part of life right so diversity help people to appreciate humanity and human right so there are different states of india and are best example for this factors so this diversity so our like uh, differences in our state or categorization of our state is based on cultural diversity so which is the best example of cultural diversity in our country that means my migrants coming from different part of the world they will diffuse their culture to the destination country so this may uh, you know eliminates racism discrimination and any kind of caste evil in the country the caste evil that is uh, faced in that country okay now negative impact of migraine uh, migration in the destination country so this were the positive impact whatever we discussed now what are the negative impact that a destination country experience first thing that is loss of job now immigrants may also cause a problem to job loss job issues as a local often lose job to the incoming workers for example the cheap labor coming from bangladesh to india or maybe from other less developed countries to our countries the indians who are the local people they have to lose their job because the uh, employers will hire the less uh, hire the laborers who can work in less 
you know wage so thereby the local will lo- lose their job secondly there will be discrimination or racism now immigration can also increase racism and discrimination now immigrants who cannot speak the local language or do not behave like the local often find themselves not accepted in their communities people may ignore them or not have anything to do with them so indian living in the usa and australia have been facing such discrimination in the recent past as well as in the recent times so let us take in one more example for racial discrimination that our country within our country like people from north east india if they go and settle in the metropolitan cities like delhi bangalore in this in this cities they have to face uh, the uh, you know e- uh, evil effect of discrimination like based on their facial structure based on their color of their skin based on their height their outlook they are discriminated right so this is one of the important you know uh, negative impact that uh, our destination country has to face now thirdly social or civil pressure will be, will be there if the immigrants coming from other countries reaching to the destination country then destination country will face some social or civil pressure now what are all this now housing health education and many other facilities may suffer from pressure of excessive use by more and more people than it was designed to take like earlier there were 100 of people living in a particular uh, reason now number of migrants are coming to that particular city because of which now demand of electricity demand of housing facilities demand for education demand for the electricity is also increasing now the local government is not able to supply, uh, not not able to supply those uh, facilities to those people living in that particular localities thereby there will be a civil pressure other people also local people also has to face problem uh, related to education related to housing and related to health so this this can force uh, force price of such amenities to go high causing hardship to all to all people living there rising slums squatter settlement will be there poor housing and sanitation will be there insufficient supply of water will be there Elect- electricity are the consequence of rural and urban migration so third uh, fourthly there will be a breakdown of culture and tradition obviously that my migrant coming from other society or other community will diffuse their culture now tradition and cultures are the negative modi- uh, modified because of negatively modified because of diversity sometimes healthy way of lives are given up as different people are exposed to different way of doing things sometimes new crime incidents emerge or increase because of bad people coming in right so people who has been living in a you know a negative culture if they are migrating to a destination country if they are reaching to a new country they will also uh, you know pollute that environment of that destination uh, country okay and the fifth uh, impact of the uh, migration or immigrants on the destination country is as long as people move from place to place there is a risk of outbreak of contagious diseases some deadliest contagious deadliest con- uh, contagious diseases in the world which spread due to immigration or uh, migration uh, tuberculosis infectious diarrhea hiv aids okay these are some of the and um, ebola are some of the uh, diseases fatal some are fatal diseases which are transmitted or these are carried out by the immigrants right so these are some of the negative impact of migration on a destination now the second part of the topic will be discussing in the next class till then stay tuned thank you for watching